So we have arteria axillaris, which divides into arteria subscapularis and arteria brachialis. Arteria subscapularis divides into um, circumflexa humeri caudalis, which divides into the thoracodorsalis, arteria thoracodorsalis, and further in are the rami proximalis. And, and the arteria collateralis radialis, only in ruminants, pigs, and carnivores. And then continuing along the arteria subscapularis, we have the circumflexa scapulae, which comes off the um, subscapularis going into the into there. The natural surface of the bone. And then um, we have arteria brachialis. First division is missing, which is the circumflexa humeri cranialis. And then we have the uh, arteria profunda brachii. Profunda brachii, which supplies the triceps brachii. And then continuing along the brachialis is the uh, arteria bicipitalis and the arteria transversa cubiti. And then continuing on to the arteria interossea communis, communis which goes into the spatium interosseum. And then from that point it becomes arteria mediana. And arteria mediana has the um, arteria radiale and then continues to the limb with the anastomosis with the vein. And then, and then we have the superficial vena system, the vena cephalica, and then we have the deep um, vena system, which is the vena um, axillaris. The vena axillaris, which again has the um, vena subscapularis, the vena brachialis, the vena circumflexa humeri caudalis, with the same branch as the thoracodorsalis, and so on.